here are the examples you can use for ray tracing and making your drawings so that you can make measurements of the angle of incident and angle of reflection. You will need a bright screen displaying this video, a piece of paper and pencil so that when you overlay the paper on the screen, you can do the ray tracing. Use this as your first angle. Here is the second angle. Here is the third angle. Remember, in the complete drawing, you will still need to have traced out and labeled the edge of the mirror, the incident rays, the reflected rays, the normal to the surface, and have measured the angles of incidence and angles of reflection. Here is a second set, just in case you had trouble with the measurements on the first one. Here is the first angle. Here is a second angle. And here is a third angle. 